Uh, you know, Andy said on a panel yesterday that this season is different because you and Teresa kind of openly hate each other this season. Right. That I think it's a very authentic season. I think that's the word he was looking for. Um, it's authentic. To me, it's one of my favorites for sure. Why do you say that? Is it your favorite because now you don't have to kind of pretend anymore or is it like you don't have to deal with that extra added stress? I think it's the stress. It felt lighter. It felt refreshing. Um, I wasn't trying to like block punches and accusations and you know character assassinations. And so I think it's a lighter season. For me, it's one of my favorite that we filmed yet. Did it give you a chance to explore other relationships with other people? Oh, I love you. It really did, and it wasn't so like oh the saga of the family. I feel like everyone's done with that. Um, including us, right? So let's be authentic and be done with it. We don't want to see it anymore. I, you know, I need to protect my peace. I've created boundaries, and I'm happy. Joe's, we, we're just feeling lighter, and it's the way to be. We have our own children to worry about. Life is short. Look at what's happening in the world right now. If life is causing, you know, bumps in the road the way they have for so many years, it's time to let it go. Chapter is officially yes. closed for you. Chapter is just. You know, I think I think we were taking a minute. Yes. What happened with Joe in the comedy show? Oh my God! So somebody reached out. It was AI. They reached out to his manager. Said they worked at Brad Garrett's comedy show. Wanted to book Joe. Sent a fake contract. Told Joe, here's the link to sell tickets. And he promoted it for like one day. And then I guess it got back to Brad Garrett. And he was like, we're not. We don't have this show. And we were like, holy shit. And we had to take it down, and it was all a fake scammer, scamming Joe and scamming everyone else. He must have been so upset. He was, I was, he was like, I knew that was too good to be true. I was like, oh, I felt bad for him, you know, but it's fine. It happens. It's not fine. These people are like, it's terrible that this goes, the world is scary. It is scary right now, you know, so, yeah. What's your daughter doing at school? Awesome. Oh, my God. She's thriving. Like, I've never seen Antonia thrive like she is. She really is, like, finding herself when she's into herself, so it's great. Good. How's married life going? Amazing. Um, married life, yeah, it's really good. It's really good. We're still newlyweds, so, yeah. Yes, you got over that, the one-year hump, so we're yeah. doing good. Cool. Yeah. How would you describe this? Oh, I, like, I like being newlyweds. It's fun, yeah. 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 What's the best part? I mean, like... Like, we always try to always make each other happy, which I think is good. Like Having a cool partner. Like, not you know, not taking each other for granted, you know, yeah. like that. Yeah. So, You know, coming off last season, it was a very intense season, a very intense reunion. So what was your mindset going into this season, and did it change at all? Because obviously you've been doing this for years. So what was your mindset going into this well, season? Bad for him. Yeah, um, yeah just um, ignore, you know, the nonsense. Mm -hmm. That's it. Yeah. Focus on our family. Ourselves. That's it, just, yeah, and that's what yeah. we've been doing. You know, Andy said at a panel earlier today that this season of Jersey is different because you and Melissa openly hate each other this season. What's kind of your reaction to that? At the reunion. No, that chapter's closed. Chapter's yeah. Closed. So yes. Did, and so do the two of you do not have any interaction at all this season? Chapter's closed. Yeah. How do you feel about that? I know that you've had some time to like marinate with that and think about that. I don't even want to comment on it. It's been like so long now, like I'm so over that. Yeah, chapter's closed. Having that chapter closed, was this season easier for you then? Because you didn't have to... Yes. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't say easier. You have to watch it because, it, you know, it's like, oh, it's always about that as, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, so I wouldn't, you know. But let's see what happens. I don't know, God willing, there'll be a, a next year, but... Yeah, so you have to, you know, watch the season to see, you know? How do you feel like Teresa? But I'm glad, you know, that aspect of it. Yeah, no, you have to watch the season. No, 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 watch the totally. season, yeah. Do you feel like it's been, like, a bit lighter for you, like, not having that extra drama in your life, Louis? No, there's still, <laughs> yeah, you need to watch the season, yeah. Um, thoughts on you and Jackie are close again. Did you ever think that was going to happen? She wrote about me in her book, yeah. What, did, yeah. Uh, what, did, what, was, what was your reaction when you read about what she said about you in the book? You're going to have to watch the okay. season, unfortunately. <laughs> I'm sorry. But did you think that that friendship, was that was that going to be a friendship to, that you ever thought would be forged? Well, I know we were trying, yeah. but, you know, she she had people in her ear. So, but the, you're going to have to watch to see how it plays out, yeah. The queen of the teas. I love it. Yeah. And he said on, I think, one of the panels yesterday that this season of Jersey is different because Melissa and Teresa kind of like openly hate each other. 
Yes, that is true. It's yeah. different. It definitely is. I've only this is only my second season, but it's definitely different from my first. Yeah. How so? I mean, you know, it's hard when two cast members are not really even acknowledging each other. So and it's sad and it's complicated. So you know, it just unfortunately is what it is. Maybe it's better than the crazy fighting. You know, yeah. maybe this is a better alternative. Yeah. It gives people, other people, opportunities to fight. Yes, that's very true. That is well said. True. Yeah. Well, I know that you and Margaret are not in the best of places. Yeah. We're not. That, and that was surprising for you. Uh, yeah, very surprising for me. But you know what? You know, people, sometimes friendships, you know, they evolve. They come to an end, you know? And how are you and Margaret? Because obviously you and Margaret are very good friends. And we are very, very good friends. We are very, very good friends. I'm good friends with Jack. I'm everybody. He's my good friend. But I'm good. I don't good. put you in the middle. Never. No, no neither one of them do. Yeah. I'm very th and I'm very grateful for that. Yeah. yeah. How would you describe your friendship with Teresa? Um, growing. New, growing, and like... Mutually respectful. Yeah. Unexpected. Unexpected. And kind of made the first move to. It was really organic. It was like we were just like talking at a party and then we were talking more and then we started calling each other and then we hung out and like started hugging. Like we like each other. Yeah. It really grew organically. You look gorgeous. Oh, thank you. So do you. Thank so you. good to see uh -huh. you. Bravo. I love um, that you and Giselle had a, oh, not Giselle, you and Garcelle had a matching dress yes. moment last Garcelle and I had the matching dress. As Andy said, lightning strikes twice. I love it so much. You know, in a panel yesterday, Andy was talking about the upcoming season of New Jersey and said, obviously, this season is different because Teresa and Melissa openly hate each other this season. Yeah, do you agree? agree with that? Well, yeah. I mean, that's no shock. Right. That's a, That's been for years. Right, but now it's out in the open. It's out in the open. I've known. <laughs> so how did that kind of change things this season? It's, uh, you know what? I think it was fine. I think it's better to be honest about the way you really feel. I've always been honest about the way I feel, so I'm just happy it's out in the open. Yeah, definitely. You know, um, a lot of people are wondering where you stand with Jackie now that the season's kind of wrapped up. Did things change between the two of you? I'm cordial to Jackie. You know what? I will always love her. Um... You know, I just think we're just not in a good place. I mean, Joe saw her the other night. You were great. Yeah. You're, you're very sweet we, to her. We get along. You know what? I'm not, I'm not that person who's, like, ever going to be mean to her. I have a soft spot in my heart for her. But she's just, we're not in a good space. Yeah. Are you, like, kind of, like, still scratching your head as to that, why she's friends with Teresa now? No, I don't care that she's friends with Teresa. I think um, it's not very authentic to who she really is. But... You know, some people need to feel relevant. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How about, you know, what can you tease about the whole Jennifer Danielle drama that kind of goes down this I season? Mean, everybody knows they had drama, you know, but I think sometimes when you're good friends, that cuts the deepest. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. How are you guys doing? Good? Uh, Marge and I? Yeah. Oh, perfect. Better I know. than ever. Yeah, you know, Joe and I, we're always a happy little duo, yeah. right, Joe? You no. Know, we really don't argue or that. I listen a lot, that's yes. why. We don't argue a lot because he's a great listener. Right. What do you think about Frank Sr. getting engaged? Oh, my oh, God. Oh, that's tremendous. We're so happy. Oh Him and Brittany are such an amazing couple. She's a little doll. Frank's never been happier. No, yeah. not at all. We're so happy for him. Fantastic. Thank you. I she feel, does, right? I do. Yeah. I feel good. So I'm down like 20-something pounds. I haven't been this weight since 1988. So, yeah, I'm feeling good. Yeah. Just, like, hit the gym real hard? No, like, Majoro. Yeah, and the gym. Yeah. And the gym, though. Oh, he so makes hard. me go she to the gym. She works out really hard in the gym. It's, I do work out hard. And she eats good. Yeah. Now. And I don't eat junk, but I like my McDonald's, so that's the truth, Paul. I have to tell the truth oh, all the time. Okay. But Guilty pleasure. I looked out the window and I saw McDonald's is in the parking lot downstairs and I was like, Whoa. The steps. To me. It's like it's 27 steps here. <laughs> I love it. So how would you describe this season? I know we talked a little bit about Action it. Action packed. Uh, you won't be disappointed. It's very surprising. It's very unpredictable. And there's going to be a lot of emotions watching it even. Andy said on the panel earlier that Jersey is different this season because Teresa and Melissa just openly hate each other. How do you? What's your reaction to that? That's true. It's true. Yeah. And how? I hate to say I don't like to say the word hate. I w I grew up. You were allowed to swear in my house and say everything but two words. You can't say the word hate or God's name in vain. And that really is a very strong word. But I I mean. I don't think there's any coming back. It's very, very sad. Both look fantastic. Thank you. So I, 
we're, we're on good terms? We're good? Yes. Okay, good. Yes. We left off the reunion that you were open to having a, a friendship. So how did this kind of, uh, how did this friendship kind of forge? You know, we had to tie up some loose ends and have some hard conversations, but we're good now. Yeah. So you guys will get to see how that comes to fruition. Yep. I'm happy about it because I really wanted this friendship to work. Yeah. I needed someone like her joining this group of friends, so it's all good. Yeah, you know, Andy said on a panel yesterday that this season is different because Teresa and Melissa kind of like openly hate each other this season. Do you, uh, is that accurate? Yeah, I think so. They didn't, I don't feel like they really talked a whole lot about each other. So that says a lot, like silence speak volumes, you know? It's very surprising. People are thinking one thing and it's not the case at all. Like. That, that 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 story is ended, I think, yeah. in a way. They, they figured out how to coexist. Yeah. How did it change the dynamic then this season? Did new friendships were able to forge and blossom? Yeah. yeah. New yeah. Both ways. Up and down. I don't down think it was as a result of them though. I agreed. I don't think I so just either. think like we all kind of got our footing and we were just figured it out a little bit. What went down? What can you tell us about what happened with Jennifer? It's unfortunate, it's disappoint I was very disappointed. A lot. It's a big story to unpack, and um, I hope the audience watches and good wins. I hope people will see that good will always win. Laura told us it's something that you're going to have to like rewatch twice. Probably. There's a lot of things you might have to rewatch twice. <laughs> yes, I will second that. Yeah. Do you foresee a friendship with her in the future, or is that kind of done? I don't know. We just finished five minutes ago, right, so I don't know. Talk anything, to me in a couple of months. Anything's possible. You can't be so definitive in this world because you never know. You're out of the pool house? Yes. I'm, I'm in the pool house. We're sharing now. We're sharing. We're in the pool house. Yes, yes. You know, Andy said in a panel earlier this morning that the season of Jersey is different because Teresa and Melissa openly hate each other this mm -hmm. season. Do you agree with that sentiment? Is that kind of what happens? I mean, I think this season is definitely a continuation of like a pickup of what happened last season. And I think people are going to really get to see. And like, listen, it's always difficult to navigate through family. So it's just best for them to like figure it out and hope for the best. Just like in real life of all of us, family feuds don't get resolved in one year, one season. I mean, if you year, think about season. it, like Jackie doesn't talk to her sister. And um, there are a lot of people don't talk to my, my uncles didn't talk to each other. Like sometimes in life and family, it's difficult. And you just want to hope for the best. Yeah. What happened with you between you and Danielle this season? Oh my god, I would just like to say that like we just finished our finale last week. So everything's kind of like really fresh and I really want to concentrate on the positive. You know last year it wasn't so I had a few non so positive incidences and I just don't want that to ruin my vibe. Like BravoCon is all about meeting the fans. We're in Vegas, like the energy is palpable. They're pumping oxygen, like everyone's happy, like we're happy here. We're happy here. So I want to concentrate on happy right, things. We're yeah. Concentrate we're on the good things. The good but thing. overall good season for you though? Yeah, you know what? Listen, I'm always true to who I am and sometimes like I speak before I think. But I also think that makes great TV. So yeah. hopefully you guys are gonna enjoy this season. What did you think about Jackie's book? I loved it. I loved it. I was I read it from start to finish. I got a lot of perspective on some of the behaviors that I've seen knowing her, now a lot of things make sense. And I just like think she's so brave to put it all out there. Mm -hmm. And she looks great and she's thriving. Yeah. So I'm happy to like have this new friendship with her. Yeah. Her having a friendship with Teresa. Yeah, I mean listen, this is this show's about friendships. You know, I know it's about con uh, conflict, but the friendships is why people watch. They don't want to see people fighting all the time. They like the people fighting, but they like the people making up better. Very, very true. Well, I cannot yeah. wait for this season. I'm so excited. I know. I can't yeah. wait. I can't right. wait to talk can't to you wait. more about right. it. Right. <laughs>